Isaac's only four months old. The moment my sister found out he'd got sickle cell, I promised I'd find a way to help him, so I'm totally buzzing about all of this. I'm not even bothered about the pain. It really doesn't hurt. But I'm so sorry, Tyler. I'm afraid you won't be able to donate today. What? You're joking, right? I'm really sorry. I don't understand. I've been wanting to give blood for ages. It's because you ticked the box to indicate what kind of sex you've had with a new partner recently. But I thought gay men were allowed to donate now. Didn't the law change? Yeah, it did. Sorry, I don't get it. Look, our questionnaires are gender and sexuality neutral, but certain uh, kinds of sexual activity are higher risk. So some donors have a greater chance of exposure to infections than others. But we always use condoms and we haven't been with anyone else, I swear. The thing is, until you've been together and exclusive for three months, you won't be able to donate. Well, I'm so sorry if this seems unfair, but these rules are in place to protect the people who receive the donations. Some infections take up to three months to show up in the blood, so we have to be ultra careful. What am I going to tell my dad? He was so proud of me for persuading Bear to organise all this for Isaac. He doesn't even know I'm gay. This is completely confidential. You don't have to explain why you didn't donate. I've tried to come out to him so many times, but... I'm sure you'll find a way when you're ready. OK, and if you're really keen to help, you can come back when the three months is up and start making regular donations. Dad comes down later. What am I going to say? I thought society was different now. I thought we were inclusive these days. Blood donation is more inclusive than it's ever been. Then why can't my gay son donate his blood? Look, I can't discuss specifics without breaching confidentiality, but we don't ask people's sexuality these days. The questions are about whether people have had certain kinds of sex and how recently. Look. Everybody has to answer these questions. It doesn't matter what their gender or sexuality. We're just trying to assess risk, that's all. Are you okay? Yeah. Should I get Tyler? Uh, your dad wants you. You're doing great, Bear. Just keep breathing like you're doing and... There. Cannula's in. Ten minutes and you'll be done. Well... Yeah, no, that really wasn't too bad at all. You feel OK? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, I could probably do it again. <laughs> Told you I'd thought it. Very creative.